Right now, we're tracking some showers close to home, but after a beautiful day today, we're expecting more sunshine for the rest of the week. Actually, most of the United States saw sunshine today. We're looking at all the way from the Great Plains to the Carolinas, a few showers heading off the East Coast. Other than that, the high pressure, plenty of sunshine and dry conditions. That's the key word. Not seeing that so much here in the valley. We are seeing a few showers. The bulk of the rain is moving out, however. We've seen showers probably for the last hour or so. We're only going to see them again for the next hour, and then it's going to be those hit or miss showers throughout the rest of the evening. So, for the most part, tracking the heavier showers just south of Columbiana County, but also seeing a few of those begin to linger and push into Trumbull County. We're looking near Warren. Now, we haven't seen any strikes of lightning with this. We're expecting some heavier showers. But nothing too significant, especially as we head into our Mother's Day forecast. The heaviest of showers right near Mecca, also just around Warren. We're looking at another heavier shower. And then if we look, it's going to be those spotty hit or miss showers throughout Mercer. And if we look south as well, seeing some dry conditions, especially on the western part of the counties, as that rain continues to push out and east of the area. That's the good news for tonight is we will eventually be dry. Also, it's going to be another cold night. We're looking at chilly temperatures dropping down to the 40s, but throughout the board already into the low 50s. Now, our temperatures won't drop too much because of the cloudy conditions. Also, the rain keeping things from us going back down into the 30s. But check out the temperatures as we go throughout Future Tracker. Now, Future Tracker now doing a good job pinpointing those showers and where they are. The heaviest of showers and this bulk will push out by midnight tonight, and then we'll see some hit or miss showers. Hours, especially heading into 1, 2 o'clock in the morning. But watch temperatures. We're only going to drop back down into the upper 40s for tonight, and then we're going to hit 60s by tomorrow afternoon. We're going to track that out for you. Upper 50s, or excuse me, upper 60s, 67 in Salem, 68 in Columbiana. Now, these temperatures will continue, especially as we head into the overnight hours, and then we get into Monday morning, which is going to be a different story. But for our Mother's Day forecast, this is what we're expecting. Partly sunny skies. Highs in the mid 60s, that chance for rain just around a 20%. So, that bulk of the rain that we're seeing now, it's going to be out of the area, but could see an early morning shower. And then, as we head throughout the rest of the week, starting with Monday, we are expecting dry conditions, but cooler temperatures. Look over Hanoverton, 39 degrees expected. Unfortunately, for Monday morning, you're going to need another jacket heading to the bus stop on Monday. But those warmer temperatures back into the forecast, we're looking again back into the mid 60s, upper 60s for Monday afternoon. And then as we head throughout the rest of the week, temperatures will only go up from there. But before we get there, though, temperatures tonight, 48 as a low, 30% chance of rain, partly cloudy skies, but we will clear up by tomorrow afternoon. Partly sunny by the afternoon, high 65 degrees, only keeping a 20% chance of rain in there. And then as we go throughout the evening hours, check out this. Warmer temperatures, plenty of sunshine. We're looking at sun for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then even as we get into Wednesday, high 85 degrees, and then rain chances back by the time we get into Thursday and Friday. You're watching 27 First News at 11.